Let me thank you all for being with us. You may ask, why are you all here? Well, it's to celebrate Amma and Papaji's colorful book of life. Let me start by saying I know why the Malhotras are here. It's because of Papaji's height. Yes, Papaji was a star student, a topper in the metric exam, and so the railways came to recruit this bright young lad. But, as luck would have it, the day the recruiters came to the house, Papaji was having a bath outside. Now, perhaps they were unreasonable to be hoping for a Dara Singh, but they took one look at the little kid and ran off. Papaji comes from a very poor background in Banaras. Amma comes from a well-off background from Sindh, Pakistan. In 1947, Amma was flown, yes, flown, out of Pakistan to Banaras just before the partition. So how on earth did these two meet? Papaji, being a failed railway clerk, became a very successful academic and continued topping all his classes. So here was Papaji, an eligible bachelor lecturer in Banaras Hindi University and doing his PhD in organic chemistry. But something was missing, a companion. He met Amma, one of his students at BHU, and he was smitten. Chand si mehbooba ho meri kab aisa maine socha tha Ha tum bilkul vaisi ho jaisa maine socha tha But as they say, boy taking much interest, girl taking no interest. So we imagine the scene to be a bit like this. <laughs> Papaji was undeterred and he waited outside the girls' hostel gate at BHU every evening just to catch a glance of Amma. Amma was convinced the only way to get rid of the young bachelor hanging outside her gate was to agree to marry him. So they were married on February 5, 1957. The scandalous love marriage between a professor and a student and a Punjabi and a Sindhi made all the newspapers. They quickly became Mam Saab and Sunye to each other. Mam Saab? Sunye. Mam Saab? Sunye? Mam Saab? Sunye! But we are getting ahead of the story. That comes much later. Soon after the wedding, Papaji left for Germany to pursue a second PhD. Yes, you heard it right. A second PhD. Papaji already had an academic post, but decided that one PhD was simply not enough. He worked hard in Germany, but his thoughts were on Amma. And they lived by the stream of letters back and forth. My dear Mam Saab, Freiburg is a beautiful town. There's a clock tower in the center of the town, and there are statues of Aristotle on one side and Homer on the other. My dear Mam Saab, Tumhara gana pasand aya, lekin usme spelling mistakes thi. Aage se tum mujhe hindi mein likhna aur main tumhari galtiyan correct kar dunga. That way, your hindi will improve. Chandrasekhar ji dance classes khol rahe hain. Main join kar loo. My dear Mam Saab, tum B.Ed kyon nahi join karti? Mrs. Shukla flower arranging sikha rahi hain. 
मैं भी सीख रही हूँ माई डियर मैम साहब तुम कुकिंग क्लासेस क्यों नहीं ज्वाइन करती And so these letters helped two years pass quickly, which was all the time that Papa Ji needed to finish his PhD, which he achieved magna cum laude. But more importantly, Amma joined him in Germany, and then the song changed to "Roti me tum, parathe me tum, chai me tum hi tum." There were offers from England and the U.S., but Amma insisted that they return to India. as she promised papa ji's grandmother that she will bring him back not for the railway clerk job but to be closer to her and so they did and they set up house and soon chun chun karti aayi chidiya chun chun karti aayi chidiya dal ka dana laayi chidiya mor bhi aaya kawa bhi aaya chuha bhi aaya bandar bhi aaya चुन चुन करती आई चिड़िया चुन चुन करती आई चिड़िया दाल का दाना लाई चिड़िया मोर भी आया कौआ भी आया चूहा भी आया बंदर भी आया चुन चुन करती आई चिड़िया एंड देन वन डे समाइम इन 1966 देर वॉज द कॉन्वर्सेशन मैम साहब अमेरिका से ऑफर आए हैं अब केवल इतने पैसे हैं कि या तो सारी फैमिली अमेरिका जा सकती हैं या घर खरीद सकते हैं आपका क्या ख्याल है ये भी कोई पूछने की बात है अमेरिका ऑफ कोर्स एंड सो लाइफ कंटिन्यूड विदिन्यूडिंग Papa's gonna buy you a diamond ring, and if that diamond ring is brass, Papa's gonna buy you a looking glass, and if that looking glass gets broke, Papa's gonna buy you a horse and yoke. Then back to India, and then back to U.S. again. Now you know why the Malhotras don't make up their minds so easily. Because I'm the candy man. can make a sunrise sprinkle it with you sprinkle it with you cover it with chocolate and a miracle to the candy man the candy man who the candy man can the candy man can the candy man can cause he mixes it with love and mix papa ji published papers amma was also busy giving cooking lessons and publishing a cookbook life was good in eugene oregon but something called papa ji back to india and the family returned to banaras and settled there for good papa ji flourished as an academic he founded the department of biochemistry and the institute of biotechnology amma raised three children and made the world's best parathas सुन 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 कहाँ चली कहाँ चली डेकेट फाइल्ड ऑन डेकेट एंड द किड्स लेफ्ट होम बट सुन with some additions some subtractions some dejection some jubilation some hurry and some delay the malhotra numbers doubled
And then the numbers grew even more. The Malhotras have roots not only in Banaras, but also here in Richmond, and indeed in many places. They have friends who welcome them like family, and family for whom Amma and Papaji are like their own parents. All of these cherished people have made their lives something more colorful and more wonderful. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them blue for me and you And I think to myself What a wonderful world I see skies of blue And clouds of white The bright blessed day Dark sacred night And I think to myself What a wonderful world Yes, I think to myself What a wonderful world And throughout, they have been each other's pillars. Ah, yes, they fight and argue and generally seem to be opposite of each other. But they complete each other. You talk to Papaji and he mentions Amma in every sentence. And God forbid if Papaji is late coming home. Amma worries everyone out of their wits. And so the story continues. <laughs> जोहरज भी तुझे मालूम नहीं तू अभी तक है हसी और मैं जवान तुझ पे कुर्बान मेरी जान मेरी जान ए मेरी जोहरज भी तुझे मालूम नहीं तू अभी तक है हसी और मैं जवान तुझ पे कुर्बान मेरी जान मेरी जान 